everyone, this is Jason Shadrick with PremierGuitar.com. We're with Jack here from Analog Alien, and we were just listening to the new Joe Walsh double classic pedal That's you it. guys made for Joe, right. and now you're going to be offering it to the public. Yes. So tell us a little about how this kind of collaboration came together and what he was looking for when he asked you to make this pedal. Well, what had happened was Joe uh, heard of the rumble seat, and he took a couple of them on the road when he was out you know, with his own tour and with the Eagles, and he liked it so much, he gave us a call one day and he said, you know, I'd like you to do a pedal for me. And what he was looking for was a compressor and a, a, an overdrive section that sounded like a lot of the amps that he's used in the past, primarily like old tweed amps. So we uh, got together with him, made a few prototypes, and uh, then met him in New York, and he approved it and uh, put his name on it, and now he's on the road with it, he's yeah. using it, yeah. So this is kind of like a two-in-one pedal, so yes. kind of describe each side of it and we'll see if we can demonstrate what they do. All right, the first side we have is the compressor. It's very smooth. It's a bypass channel. He, uh, he doesn't like compression that's over the top. So you can just hear how smooth, even at higher ratios. You have a sensitivity control. So without it, with it, he basically leaves it in a lot. The other side is the um, classic amp, so at lower gain settings we have a bass, a treble, wide range of uh, frequencies that you can select from. I can scoop the treble out, kick it in. Bass is really strong in it. And he's, uh, he's not much of a fuzz guy, he doesn't like that. What he likes is like really heavy overdrive. If you listen to his music and all the stuff he's done with the James Gang and the Eagles and whatever, it's, it's basically just more of a classic sound. If I increase the gain, you don't lose the personality of the guitar. Even at higher gain settings. And if you get the compressor in, the other feature that we added here was because they're both in a pedal, uh, what Joe likes to do is he actually likes to put the compressor, usually it's before the uh, overdrive effect, but he actually likes to put the overdrive in front of the compressor. So we added a pre-post switch, which just takes the compressor and puts it before or after the, uh, the classic amp. There's a little relay network in there that, that does that. And that's it. It's a basically simple, straightforward amp. He's been touring with it and uh, using it in the studio, using it live. And, um, yeah. and also new for this year, we have the bucket seat. The bucket seat is the uh, rumble drive section of the rumble seat. Uh, we were getting a lot of requests, a lot of emails saying, could you just give us that, that overdrive section to just put it in you know, one pedal? So we have that flavor, you know, we can have that on the board. So that's what we did, and that's basically what this one's all about. Let's see, can we hear a little bit of it? Sure. So lower settings. That's the bucket seat. It's identical to the, the uh, Rumble seat drive. And what would be the, the pricing and availability on that? Uh, it's available now at uh, all our dealers, and the street price is $199. Yeah, that's about it. That's and what uh, what will be the pricing and availability on the Double Classic? This is uh, 299 Street. It's available now at all our dealers. You can get on our website and uh, go to our dealer page, and you'll you know see all the dealers there. Everyone has it. So it's, it's out right now, actually. All right, Jack, thank you so much for showing us around, man. Thank you, bud. This is Jason Shadrick with PremierGuitar.com. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all of our NAM 2016 coverage. Jack, let's hear a little bit more.